to welcome all of you to our Purple Heart Recognition Day. I would especially like to welcome all of the veterans and military organizations here today. America is strong and great because of you. Today is our 11th anniversary of this recognition here in Dunedin. On this special day of recognition, help us to remember with deepest gratitude and awe the extraordinary men and women who out of love placed themselves in harm's way and some even giving their lives to protect our country and preserve our liberty. Let's keep these heroes in our loving care. Whose bright stripes and bright stars. I am so honored and proud to see all these wonderful faces around us today, um, especially all of our veterans. Let's give them another round of applause, please. I want to congratulate them for their continued leadership in this county and, and honoring veterans. It's because of you that we're able to do things like this today. And this is all about veterans and all about the Purple Heart recipient. Quilters across the country, men and women, we present these quilts, our veterans and their families, to thank them for their service, their sacrifice, and their valor. And I'm in awe right now to be around other Purple Heart recipients because we really understand what it really means to, ha to, to be presented that. And for those of you that support us, all the Purple Heart recipients, not only that, but all of the veterans here, I thank you from the bottom of my heart. Too often we think of all these recipients as old people having served in only the world wars. We are here to remind you that even today on foreign shores, veterans are being awarded this prestigious medal. 